Hello and welcome friends to us today's video presentation where we will be exploring the profound meaning behind the armor of God. This powerful metaphor is drawn from the Bible, specifically from Ephesians 6 verse 10 to 18. We will dive into its significance and why it is crucial to wear this spiritual armor daily. So let's dive in. Let's read first Ephesians chapter 6 verse 10 to 18. Finally be strong in the Lord and in his mighty power. Put on the full armor of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's schemes. For our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the authorities, against the powers of this dark world and against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly realms. Therefore, put on the full armor of God, so that when the day of evil comes, you may be able to stand your ground, and after you have done everything, you stand. Stand firm then, with the belt of truth buckled around your waist, with the breastplate of righteousness in place, and with your feet fitted with the readiness that comes from the gospel of peace. In addition to all this, take up the shield of faith, with which you can extinguish all the flaming arrows of the evil one. Take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the Spirit, which is the word of God, and pray in the Spirit on all occasions, all kinds of prayers and requests. With this in mind, be alert and always keep on praying for all the Lord's people. This is very, very profound. Now, the armor of God is a metaphor used by the Apostle Paul in his letter to the Ephesians. It represents a set of spiritual tools and protections that Christians should put on daily to stand strong against the challenges and temptations of life, particularly those of a spiritual nature. So let's break it down for you to understand it better. The first thing we are going to talk about is the belt of truth. The first piece of the armor represents truth and integrity. In a world filled with deceit, the truth keeps us grounded. The second one, breastplate of righteousness. This protects the heart and signifies living a righteous life, following God's moral standards. And the third, feed short with the gospel of peace. Be prepared to share the message of peace and salvation, spreading the word of God wherever we go. The shield of faith, a shield of unwavering faith, which deflects doubt and fears like arrows, keeping us secured in our belief. The fifth one is the helmet of salvation. The assurance of salvation that we have through Christ guards our minds from doubt and despair. And the sixth one is the sword of the Spirit, which is the Word of God, is our offensive weapon, a powerful tool for spiritual warfare. And the seventh and the least, Prayer. Prayer connects us with God, maintaining an open line of communication, allowing us to seek His guidance and protection always. Now, why is it vital to put on this armor daily? The answer lies in the spiritual battles we face. While we may not see them with our physical eyes, they are very real. These battles include temptation, doubt, fear and moral challenges. The armor of God equips us to stand firm and resolute in our faith. The first point I want to talk about is protection. Just as a soldier wouldn't go into battle without an armor, Christians need spiritual protection in their daily lives. Strength. This armor empowers us with the strength of God overcome adversity and remain steadfast in our beliefs. 
guide us. The armor is a reminder of the principles and values we must uphold, directing our thoughts and actions in alignment with God's will. Preparation We never know when the spiritual challenges will arise. So daily preparation ensures we are always ready to face them head on. And unity. As Christians, we are a part of a larger spiritual army. When we all wear the armor of God, we unite in our faith and become a powerful force against evil. Now, in conclusion, the armor of God is not just a metaphorical concept. It's a practical guide for living a spiritually strong and resilient life. By wearing it daily, you can face the trials and tribulations of this world with unwavering faith, integrity and a deep connection to God. Ephesians 6 verse 10 to 18 Make it a part of your daily routine. With the armor of God, you can stand firm against the challenges of life and become a beacon of life and faith in a world that often feels very, very dark. Our next video will be a, a simple prayer which you can pray with the armor of God to put it on daily. So thank you for joining us today and if you found this video meaningful, please like it, share it and subscribe. And as always, may you find strength in the armor of God as you journey through life. God bless you.